Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome Cross Watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Let's take a look and see what's manifesting for you. What's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So whenever you see this, in the case that you see it outside of June, and it resonates, take it as your message. But as always, take what resonates, leave out the rest. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually goldy on all platforms. If you are interested in a personal reading done by myself, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. Okay, so... There's someone you're having a disagreement with, or there's just like tension here. Some of you, um, it's like feeling like you're, there's like competition or like power struggles with somebody. You've tried to progress things, but there's like some drama. Why, why the five of wands? Someone's not being fair. Someone's just like, yeah. Four pentacles. Someone's like really, really guarded or like even at, to the point of like acting selfish and you're just like, yeah, no, like I, I need things to be fair. I need things to be honest. I need things to be, um, balanced for the both of us okay you may be dealing with a libra gemini aquarius also seeing pisces cancer scorpio it feels like there's a few people here though like there's a few people here that are just being rude or bitter you know what you you are on this path towards expansion and it's like you as the days go by you're finding yourself feeling more confident. You're finding yourself growing more. You're finding yourself hitting milestones. You're finding yourself getting closer and closer to success. And people see that. And people are feeling bitter. Bitter because they see something in you. They see something in you. Even if you don't see it in self, people are seeing it with you. That's why they're, they're acting better. That's why they're in survival mode. Okay. And it's crazy because you're so generous. You're so generous with your time, your energy, your in, like investment. You're so generous with people. And but but you're not going to just keep giving to people that are only taking from you. Yeah. I do see you taking action towards just um, taking a practical approach to your your life, okay? It's like staying committed, staying focused on your integrity, and staying passionate about what you're what you're fighting for. It's like, yeah, you're pushing your limits right now, where people are like really pressing your buttons. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Like people are trying you or they're trying your patience or testing your, your patience right now. But it's because you're so close to um, this like success in your life or you're so close to hitting a milestone that some people are just being triggered by this. Okay, it does look like there's an empress around you. Could be a mother figure or like, this motherly energy, someone kind of like taking you under your wing to like care for you, nurture you to life and, and really just show you a lot of love at this moment. So someone's coming in um, with this type of energy by the end of the month. It could literally be a mother, but it doesn't have to be. Now, if you have someone in mind, 
think of them. Let's take a look and see how they feel about you, for, about the situation with you for the rest of the month. Okay, yeah, they feel like things are on pause right now. They feel like they're left hanging and they're kind of uncertain about where things stand between the both of you. Look at you. Nine of Pentacles. Abundant. Glamorous. Self-sufficient. You know your self-worth. You're financially independent. You're, you, you have, you're doing really, really well for yourself here. And someone, this person just doesn't know where they stand with you. They see you being really independent or just doing your own thing right now. Um, but the thing is, they want to celebrate you. Whoever this person is, Three of Cups being their actions, this is them wanting to like celebrate or have a friendship with you even. Support you. Build a legacy with you. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, some of you, this is a friend. They're like, they don't really know where they stand with you or they just feel like um, you're doing your own thing right now. But they want to see you again. They want to celebrate you or support you. And this is like a romantic situation. This person really does feel like they want to... Build a legacy with you, a family with you, an ancestry, and celebrate with you, get closer. Okay. What are you having doubts about? You're, yeah, you're doubting yourself here. You're doubting whether or not you should keep giving to a situation or whether you should just give up and let things be what it is. I release the need to know all answers. Okay. It's like... You, I, I feel like you standing your ground and believing in yourself and, and standing in your, in your courage, your confidence, you're truly limitless that way. You're truly abundant that way. And I, I consider abundance as like having everything you need and more, you know? You, yeah, you, you are on the verge of like change. I'm just going to say that you're on the verge of change and I wouldn't doubt, I wouldn't doubt you. Okay. Yeah, there, there is a new beginning here. There's a new, there's a new adventure that you're about to reach. It's like you're at this halfway point is what I'm hearing. You're at this halfway point where you're half you're halfway you're halfway through a challenge. I'm seeing the numbers three, five. So three, 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 five, five, five. You could be seeing any of those synchronicities. I'm seeing letters B, D, H, O, N, C, Y. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said. This is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you and your patience. And I hope you have a blessed rest of your day. Bye.